Hey guys, James Seymour, aka Shalope here. Today I'm just going to be teaching you how to modify your game save for ETS2 and ATS. The things I show you are applicable to both games. Uh, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and download these two folders. Links will be down in the description. They will also be available if you need them. I can send them through Discord. Um, so you want to install the Java, well, and then you want to extract this file here, you know, using whatever extraction thing you have. You want to go to, no, those are my videos, Shh, didn't see those. Um, <laughs> you want to go here, to your Euro Truck Simulator 2 folder in your documents, go profiles, whatever letter number conversation that is, save. Um, I would recommend doing it through a quick save. I do it through a quick save and an auto save just because it's a lot easier for me because like you know if I'm out and about I'm not gonna even though quick saving honestly there's really no difference. <laughs> it's just quick save you have to press a button before auto save just your last auto save. So make a quick save by going to the game setting a button tapping that button at any time. And you'll get this folder here in your save folder. Open that up. Now, in the folder, you will see in the decryptor. Uh, you don't need the hacks folder. I don't know what that is. Bring the decryptor folder into you know, your quick save. Copy your game file. Just copy. Open that up. Now, on the SCSC Windows batch file, just right click. Left click first, sorry. Right click and click paste. You'll see this message if it worked correctly, decrypted, blah, 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 and it'll close. Go to game, and you'll see it is no longer in gibberish. So these are just companies and stuff. You don't really need to worry about that. Your main things are going to be, uh, da, 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 go up, up, uh, F, player. I let's go up. A all right, whatever. Anyways, you go click bank. You know, you just have to type in the word bank or money, and it'll be this one here: money account. Change that to whatever amount of money you need. have to go through this to find the other things that you need. They're not far down, I don't believe. These are just the garages, bus stops. Spoiler alert, they're bringing buses into ETS2. Uh, I said it's going to be similar. There are going to be some variances in the game save files, but not much. Now, if you want, say, sorry. <laughs> sorry, my mind's just kind of all over the place. If you want to uh, have more experience, put the amount of experience you want here, right there. And then these are your kind of level up things, your skill points, essentially. ADR is 63. Everything else is just 6. Um, sorry about that. Other than that, you know, you just click save. You know, open up your quick save in game. So it'll load up your game, load the quick save, and you'll see it works. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.